we do have a number of treatment options that are FDA approved and are available. They're the CGRP monoclonal antibodies as preventives. Currently, there are four that are FDA approved and are currently available and in use in clinical practice. These are arenumab, freminizumab, galcanizumab, and eptinizumab, and they're all considered level A evidence, though the guidelines have not yet been updated to include that. And this is really based on the number of clinical trials and the quality of evidence that, that they are at. For acute treatments, we have two medications in a category known as GPANs that are FDA approved for acute treatment of migraine. These are remigipan and ubrojipan, and they also would be considered level A evidence if we were to look at the data, but the guidelines have not been yet updated. They're to use when you're having a migraine attack and they work on the CGRP receptor to block the receptor. There's one medication known as a ditan, which is lasmididan, that's also FDA approved and available for acute treatment of migraine, migraine. And this would also be considered level A evidence based on um, the evidence that is available in the clinical trial data. Now, if we look at the pipeline, there is actually a lot of exciting stuff out there. And we've seen already during this meeting at the AAN some poster presentations on some of the new data. There is a nasal spray uh, G-Pant uh, that is under investigation that just completed a phase two trial that was presented at this meeting. I uh, believe it's uh, called Zvegipant, which I'm not very good at saying all of these G-Pant names. It also blocks the CGRP receptor, but it's a nasal spray. And in migraine, where our patients tend to have a lot of gastroparesis and nausea, that taking a non-oral medication is very important. So that uh, was presented the other day. There are also GPANs in investigation for migraine prevention. Remegipan, which is available as an acute treatment currently, has published reports and use every other day as a preventive treatment for migraine and found almost a one-day reduction compared to placebo for prevention of migraine. Now, it is not yet FDA approved for prevention. That is pending. So we cannot use it as a preventive option because um, it can't be written for that way at this time. So that's an important thing to understand. What is also being presented at this meeting is another GPAN called a TOGIPAN. A TOGIPAN is an oral GPAN, also blocking the CGRP receptor, and it is being investigated as an oral preventive option for migraine. And this, again, is in clinical trials. It just completed its phase three trial um, and is not yet available for um, prescription and is under investigation by the FDA.